so I'm going to be going over this video, Ace's Admiral Level, by someone of the name of Taekwon 1000 Finest. Uh, he is one of King of Lightning's friends. That's where I've seen him in King of Lightning streams. And yeah, he just speaks a bunch of blasphemy. He has a lot of blasphemous views, in my opinion. But yeah, let's just go over this video real quick. I only have like 15 minutes, so let's get it Ace started. Ace is Admiral Level Part 2. The next major fight Ace had was against Admiral Alkiji. In this fight against Admiral Alkiji, Alkiji was not playing around. So I don't want to hear Alkiji wasn't trying. When Ace was like, not Ace, when Rupi was like, I'll become as strong as you, Ace, Alkiji was like, how when you, it's no tomorrow for you? You know, so Alkiji was going to end things right there, but he was not strong enough to because when he clashed with Ace, and we got to keep in mind that Fire is a burning thing, like fire burns constantly. Ice is solid. So not only does fire melt ice, since it's burning constantly, it's like burning the ice, melting it. And with ice, it's just a solid, it's just standing in it. So you could actually see in the clash that people say it's even, and I think that's biased. Because, all right, it's even in the middle, but you see Ace has a lot of fire left, and Alkiji ice is just melting away, melting away. And that's what I mean by fire stays burning and that ice is just a solid. So it's like Ace's fire is just burning Alkiji's move up while Alkiji's move is just sitting there getting melted away. So, you know, in video games, in anime, and manga. You're wrong, though. You said that Ace has a lot of fire still. His fire has, seen, has significantly decreased right here. Basically nothing. I mean, it's a, clearly the attack was even out and you... I think you already admitted that Ace has the Devil Fruit advantage. That's all this is showing right here. Ace has his Devil Fruit advantage. Fire being super effective to Ice is a yeah. common thing. And I think that's what happened in that fight. So, you know, while Ace won, you know, it was due to an advantage, but he still won. So how and where, who said that Ace won? Where did you get that from? It was one attack. This isn't even a fight. <laughs> This, come on now, this is ridiculous. I do have Ace at A minus, and I do have Alkiji at an A, but you know those advantages is hard to overcome. So Ace won that fight. Another thing is when Good you look God. at Alkiji's face, he looks salty, like he's not happy with that outcome. And then you see the Marines, and they're like, he just banished Alkiji's ice. I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> they vaporized Alkiji's ice. Damn, I didn't know you could do that. Well, duh. And that's all I have to say about that clash. I'm not going to hold Alkiji to some higher standard because he's an admiral or say he wasn't trying, but he implicated that he was trying in the beginning or just be like, you know, he's a none of that, none of that other stuff like that. We've seen the clash. They clash. Ace won that clash. On to the next one. Ace's last and final fight was against Ad Ace didn't win this clash. It evened out because of the devil fruit. He, I don't understand. Is he implying that Ace would have a chance of defeating Aokiji. What about their physical stats? What about we look at that for a second? Black Blackbeard, Ace was hit by Blackbeard. Blackbeard hit him like one or two times. Each time that we saw Blackbeard hit Ace, he sent them flying and Ace was like spewing up blood, like throwing up blood and shit. I mean, like Jozu blindsided Aokiji with Hockey Lace Diamond, gave him a small lip bleed. If they were to fight and... If Ace were to try to damage Aokiji with like a physical attack, how is he? He's not going to be able to, right? Aokiji would more than likely be able to, to at the very least, even out all of Ace's fire moves. How is he going to hurt, or at least seriously damage? I mean, come on now. Now the same thing applies to this. I'm not going to like change things or try to justify Ace losing. He lost. But I'm just going to explain that from the start of <laughs> Hold on. Why is he using Naruto music? That's funny. The fight. Akainu taunted him. Akainu is very smart. You see, he played games with squad. Huh? So Akainu taunted Ace from the start, which made Ace act in a way where he wasn't really thinking. And, you know, he just attacked Akainu. So the attacks collide. Akainu is stronger and overpowers him. And plus, it's like, all right, it's a... An A minus clashing with an A plus, and Akainu has a double fruit. And then I don't know where he gets these grades from. 
So Ace is an A minus, and Al Kainu is an A plus, and Aokiji was an A. It's very weird. I don't know why. If that's the case, why is Ace close to? Doesn't make any sense. Against Ace, that's why Ace went down so quickly. I feel like if that advantage Akainu had wasn't there, Ace would have done a little bit better for a little bit longer, but in the end, he still would have lost. So it's that to keep in mind too. After that, you know, Akainu goes to attack Luffy, and earlier in the fight when Luffy was trying to save Ace, Ace told Luffy to go home. I have my own friends. I have my own life. He didn't, and he didn't say this out loud, but he said it to himself. He doesn't want Luffy to die trying to save him. But now, if he would have tried to strike Akainu, or if he would have tried to do something else other than what he did, which was just put himself in front of Luffy and take the blow, Luffy would have died, and that's the one thing he did not want to happen, no matter what. So... Well, hold on a second. Akainu was going after Luffy either way, whether Ace was fighting him or sacrificing himself. Akainu literally decided to go kill Luffy. I don't, I don't get your point here. He took the blow, which is like a direct attack, which is why he lost. So it's not like he's just, it's not like one punch from Akainu kills Ace. No, this was a unguarded, he just took the blow, which is like a direct attack. So, and it hit a body part. And after that, that was the end of Ace, but I will say that after analyzing everything, looking over everything, that Ace died at Maru level. That no. All right, let's read this. He fought equally with Jimmy in the past. They nearly killed each other in a fight that lasted for five days. Okay, so I guess it sort of seems like you're implying that Ace is around Jimmy level. Ace then survived a battle with Whitebeard that took place immediately after, showing immense stamina. Yeah, Ace has very good stamina. I'm not so sure about durability, but stamina for sure. If you're implying that, that Ace is around Jimbei level, or Ace and Jimbei are on the same level, or at least very close, and are you saying Jinbei is also Admiral level? I don't get that. I mean, Jinbei tried to punch, punch out Kainu when Al Kainu was chasing him, and Jinbei couldn't do any damage to him, and then he got one shot right after. <laughs> That's what I will say about that. And RIP Ace. Ace died Admiral level at A minus. No. Now, for anyone who's going to say, oh, but Ace is not Admiral level he's weaker than that i'm gonna say that smoker aside and smoke is no scrub you know luffy could have messed with smoker like that so besides smoker, Wait. ace did nothing but fight monsters he fought black i actually forgot that ace and smoker fought but i'm pretty sure ace is stronger anyways i mean blackbeard which is one of the most powerful characters in the series and blackbeard has the strongest logia fruit and ace went up against him with it and did a very outstanding job i disagree at the end of the fight a lot of it was off screen but when we pan back to the fight uh blackbeard was standing over ace laughing at him ace was on his knees i disagree i'd say at the at the very most i'd say it was like a mid to high diff blackbeard one i wouldn't i definitely not an extreme diff i'm gonna say mid to high diff uh, ace did decent i'll give him that Remember that Blackbeard was even asking, even at the end of the fight, he was still like, asking Ace to join his crew. So, I mean, you, that could also apply, like, maybe Blackbeard wasn't even going all out. But, yeah, no. Midnight diff. That's what I'll give Ace. Then, he clashed with Aokiji. Aokiji is very powerful. Like, later on, he went on to fight Akainu for 10 days. And, finally, he fought Akainu, which... It seemed like he was the most popular admiral there, and the most like bloodthirsty admiral there. So I don't think Oda would have some. We don't know. Kiz for all we know, Kizaru could. I mean, I always sort of thought of it just real quick. I always sort of thought of the admirals like rock, rock paper, scissors, right? Like Alkainu had the edge over Alkiji. Alkiji could have the edge over Kizaru. Kizaru could have the edge over Alkainu, and it's just like a three way like that. They all seem to be at the same level to me for the most part. And then not have this person be at that admiral level, level, or that top tier level that Ace was on. So, you know, if Ace wasn't admiral level, he would have fought weaker opponents. Like, he would have fought people, with, uh, you know, he would have <laughs> he would have had Ace fight people like Arlong, and he would have had Ace fight, you know, like weaker opponents like Bellamy, not the people he fought. So.
So Smoka, this is not 100% accurate, but this is something to the extent of that. Like, I think Smoka was a C before the time stands, but a C with a Loki of powers that made him hard to touch. Um, and I think, like, Luffy was probably around, like, a C-plus back then, before the time skip. So what I want to say is that these four fights that Ace had, if Smoker was a C, right? If uh, Blackbeard, I feel like Blackbeard was an A. Aokiji, an A. Aino, an A-plus. They're not going to have a character like people who's on that A rank, but huh. Admiral level, and this guy not be Admiral level as well. So he's implying Jinbei and... In- Pre time pre quake fruit blackbeard were admirable. Seriously, <laughs> that's really funny. I mean, that's just absurd. I mean, if he's putting blackbeard at a, blackbeard at like mid ace, so I mean, I guess that puts ace like at B or B plus scale. It should at least, but he obviously thinks blackbeard and ace fight was extremely. So I feel like that's more proof that ace was average. Level is that he fought nothing but people who's at Admiral level, smoker aside. This is Tycon 1000. Smoker Rangers. aside. Thanks for checking the video. Appreciate it. All right, that's all. This is just a quick video. Uh, please like the video, watch my other videos, comment, and subscribe for more. Thank you, guys. I'll be putting more videos um, in a couple days.